Well, the election is 27 days away, but tens of thousands of Minnesota have already used an absentee ballot to vote. But with a presidential campaign so unpredictable, what if something happens and you change your mind? Believe it or not, you can take back your vote. Here's Pat Kessler's reality check. It might be Donald Trump's vulgar bragging on a bus or the drip, drip, drip of Hillary Clinton emails. If it's enough to make you change your vote, you can. And that is your right as an absentee voter. Ginny Gelms is Hennepin County's election manager. She says changing your absentee vote is your legal right. Every election we do see a couple of people who want to change their mind. Do they tell you why? Uh, we don't ask and we don't want to know. <laughs> the take back your vote law applies to anyone who cast an absentee ballot before November 2nd. The Secretary of State says you can change your mind through November 1st. They can claw back and take back their ballot up to seven days, one week before the election. It's a little known fact. No one sees your absentee ballot. It's inside an unmarked envelope. That envelope slides into another, which is marked with identifying information. It's very secure, yep. In Hennepin County, all absentee ballots are secured on the 18th floor of a nearby office building. This is where 19,000 absentee ballots are already stored. If you change your vote, your local election office will retrieve your ballot. We'll actually look up the voter, we'll, we'll find the precinct that that voter lives in, we'll pull their ballot from the box, we'll reject that ballot before we issue a new ballot to the voter. Well, that's really something. Now, absentee voting in Minnesota is at a record pace. 150,000 absentee ballots have been requested and sent out, and 46,000 have been returned. That is twice as many as the presidential election in 2012. A wow. lot of interest around this election. Yeah, and is voter interest, is it true that voter interest is higher than it's ever been in Minnesota? Because that's what we keep hearing, and the numbers kind of look like it. Yeah, you know, the numbers show that, that people are really interested in this. Uh, they're setting new records everywhere in Minnesota. More people requesting no excuse absentee ballots, which allow you to vote for absentee for any reason. And more people in Minnesota are now registering to vote. 3.2 million so far registered to vote. That is the most ever in Minnesota. But if you vote absentee, change your mind in this topsy turvy presidential campaign, get it back. Wow. Interesting. All right, Pat. Thank you. you bet.